Yo, what's going on, YouTube? Man, you see this guy here? Laying on the canvas? That is none other than the gifted one, Kirkland Lane, okay? I'll show you a better picture of him, man. You get a better picture of him right here. Yeah, this is a good one. So it look like Lenny Kravitz or something like that, man. Or, um, uh, <laughs> yeah, those guys like Millie Vanilli. <laughs> Here you go. This is another picture of him. You got a good picture of him right here. The gifted one. That's Kirkland Lane, man. He's from the UK. The British dude. Um, there's another picture of him. That's the latest one. From um, Bunts, man. I think it's a guy's name, Steve Bunts or something like that. Some guy from the UK. Covers boxing. I think he's on like the Box Nation or something like that. But anyway, long story short, man. They did a documentary following up on uh, Kirkland Lane. And um, yeah, man, you know, you know, he's seen better days. I don't know what he's doing now, man. The, the documentary I saw was like, it was dated when I saw it, you know what I'm saying? So, anyway, uh, he, he seems to be in high spirits, man. Everybody talks really good about him and stuff like that, man. They always have positive stuff to say about, you know, Kirkland Lane. You know what I'm saying? They say he's a simple guy, you know, cool guy and whatnot. But, um, anyway, as far as his boxing career is concerned, man, this guy is like, um, he was like the best coulda, woulda, shoulda fighter, you know what I'm saying, like, he beat Roberto Duran, I think he fought this guy named Colin Jones, man, Colin Jones was, like, a tough, a tough out, man, I think it was, um, what had happened, they fought twice, and it turns out this dude got knocked out in the same round. <laughs> <laughs> like both of the rights and both of the fights, man. I think it was like the seventh and the eighth. Just not the seventh. Both was both of them were like in the seventh or the like the eighth round or something like that, man. I think it was like the same punch that did him in. But he always fought with his head, hands down. You know what I'm saying? He lose the outside fight and he always use like lateral movement to you know shuffle back and forth and stuff like that. You really gotta check his check out his boxing style, man. It was really interesting. And that's how he was able to beat Roberto Duran with, like, foot movement. But anyway, man, this is about him fighting this dude named, um, what's this guy's name, man? What's this chump's name? This Brian Jensen guy, man. Or Jansen. This is Brian Jensen. So he was fighting this guy, Brian Jensen, 1985, man. They're in Australia, right? Got it right here, man. Australia, Queensland, man. Um, who the hell are they fighting at? Now Brisbane, Australia. They're fighting in Brisbane, uh, Brisbane, Australia. And then, um, anyway. So long story short, man. This dude got like. This dude got robbed, man. This dude got robbed. Um. Kirk Lane, you know he was doing his thing, man. He was just showing this dude up. This dude, Brian Jensen, he was nothing special. You know what I'm saying? The, the best he ever done was, like, held a Commonwealth belt. He lost it in his first defense and stuff like that. After uh, You won't believe what happened, man. But anyway, so Kirk Lane was, like, handing it to this dude. You know what I'm saying? This dude's getting frustrated and stuff like that. So Kirk Lane, he goes down, like, the fourth or something like that. He, he slips, right? Dude gets hit, you know. The dude hit the dude on the canvas. The referee saw it. He like didn't say nothing. Like remember, this is in Australia, you know. This is in Australia. Uh, Jansen is is in his backyard. You got James Kirkland, you know the brother, you know from the UK. You know showing this dude up. You know what I'm saying he's showing this dude up, man. He's 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 outclassing this guy. So. You know, um, here comes the fifth round, right? So Kirkland Lane, man, he gets, like, pushed to the ropes, and he slips again. He falls down. Then this dude just rolls up and, like, 
chin checks him, man. Pretty much like Arthur Abraham did. Um, what was that? It was Anthony Jarrell, you know, the Matrix dude. You know, S same thing, man. You know, I get them brothers. And I don't want to say Anthony, but I think it was uh, one of the Jarrell brothers, man. I forgot the dude's name. I forgot the dude's first name. But anyway, dude got knocked down. And, um, yeah, man, Kirkland was out, man. Kirkland was out. And the dude, Brian, Brian Jansen, he admitted it. You know what I'm saying? He just admitted it. He was like, yeah, I hit him. And he should have got up or something like that. You know, I was frustrated. Yeah, I hit him while he was down on the ground. He was like, I hit him square on the jaw but after three minutes of being on a canvas and stuff like that you know um they went on the rule brian jansen the winner because they they're gonna say they don't have a no foul rule so they have like a no foul rule or whatever like that so i, I guess anything goes up in the, uh, you know australia or whatnot you know what i'm saying i guess back then 1985 i mean he just ruled him the winner, and then the judges went on and booked it down as a, you know, a knockout for Brian Jensen. But Jensen, but anyway, man, the dude he, he ain't got much of a career anyway, man. They don't even have a picture of him on box rec, so he he, he ended up being a flop, you know. Um, I mean that's we seen that happen before in Australia, man. Australia has a, a very long history of of a. Uh, Cheating people, man. Uh, Green versus um, who was that? Uh, Jones, Roy Jones. What was that? What was that guy's name? Something Green. What was that guy's name? Green. You know, he was messing with his boxing gloves. They gave uh, Roy Jones old block boxing gloves and stuff like that. What else? Uh, um, I think it was Antonio Mundine versus uh. Sugar Shane Mosley, you know, he was messing with his money or something like that. I don't even think they fought. I'm not even sure they fought or not, but I think they, I think they fought. But, yeah. dude, they, they couldn't even get his dude money on time and stuff like that. Uh, you saw the Manny Pacquiao versus Jeff Horn. Oh, man, what else, man? Shoot, man, they had so many controversies down there in Australia, man. Yeah, that's why a lot of people don't even want to go down there, you know. You know, they 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 they, they do stuff dirty down there, man. And if you see this, you'd be like, man, who, who the hell would travel? Who who the hell would travel down there and it takes a whole whole day, you know, get down there, get jet lagged, and all of a sudden, you know, you know, these guys want to cheat you and stuff like that with a no foul rule. That's wrong. All right, man. I catch y'all later. Bye.